Yo, yo. What's up, my hype bros? What's up, King? What's up, God? What's up, stars, man? What's good with it? So I ain't gonna be too long, man. My battery low. <clears throat> my voice is hoarse and shit. You know what I'm saying? I know it's been a good hot minute. But, uh, hey, bro, that's just what it is, man. Been busy. Don't have a lot of free time like I used to. You, you know what I'm saying? I'm out here getting it in. But um, you can see I got Ra shining on me, man, absorbing this sunlight. You feel me? So before we jump into the video, uh, go ahead and smash that like button, man. And, um, you know, subscribe and all that good shit. You feel me? I'm feeling good as a motherfucker, man. I just, I just got off the beach, right? Um, doing some comedic yoga on the beach, but on the new side of the beach, man. That was totally liberating and totally healing at the same motherfucking time. You know what I'm saying? Especially when you got a nice goddess with you. But anyway, uh, today's video, I just want you guys to know that <clears throat> she never, she's never really yours, bro. It's just your turn. You know what I'm saying? Women, women, uh, especially today in this dating scene, this dating market, they go from relationship to relationship and they just as liberated as men. A lot of them are very uh, promiscuous and things like that, you know? Um, you know, women are out here, you know, doing what men are doing, you feel me? But even if you are in a LTR, a long-term committed relationship, you just have to realize that your partner may not be with you until you transition, you feel me? Like even if you're married to her, uh, women go off of their emotional uh, vibrations, you know what I'm saying, and how they feel and how you make them feel and how valuable you are to them. You see what I'm saying? So whatever your resources are, whatever your value is to the woman, or however it is that you make her feel on a consistent basis, and consistency is consistency is the uh, is the key word here. The way that you consistently make her feel over time, right? Which means the dating never ends. Like I said in my book, you know, you gotta have, you gotta take her out, you gotta wind her. I'm talking about your woman, not women you just met, not women you just on a first date. No, none of that. You, you don't take women out to dinner on your first dates. You know what I'm saying? I'm not talking about first dates and shit. I'm talking about your woman. I'm talking about your lover. I'm talking about your wife, your girlfriend, someone that you've established, established physical intimacy with. These are the ones that you wine and dine. These are the ones you date regularly on a consistent basis, whether it be weekly, every other week, once a month, whatever. But with that consistency, you got to blow her mind. You got to keep her on that cloud nine you, you know what i'm saying you got to make her feel like a lady you got to be shivers you got to be kind you know plan trips plan dates fun dates uh adventurous dates what have you whether it be a park whether it be a beach date rock climbing skydive whatever the fuck it is that you guys are into do that you know what i'm saying this is what's going to keep her around but if you lose that consistency that yeah if you lose that consistency and you don't make her feel like you did in the beginning, she's gonna start to fall back. You see what I'm saying? So you have to put in the effort, you have to meet, you know? But um, in general, uh, yeah, they go off of their emotions and you gotta have that consistency in terms of, uh, you know, how you make them feel. But just understand and have it in the back of your mind that, um, you know, they're never really yours completely. It's just your turn. But as long as you're doing what you're doing, like I just suggested to you in this video, you can keep her for a long time. You know what I'm saying? And as, as long as you're uh, authentic, uh, as long as you're uh, transparent and you're honest with your objective, you tell her like, this is what I want. This is what I want with us and things like that. Um, you should be fine. But anytime you deter away from that, I guarantee you there's gonna be a fallback. There's gonna be a separation and eventually a breakup. You know what I'm saying? And, um, and even then when you break up, you just let her go away. You know what I'm saying? She changed her mind, let her hit you back up. Maybe you guys wanna you know, reconsider that or not. If not, no pressure. Life goes on, you know what I'm saying? You keep an abundance mindset, you don't get one-itis, and you keep on dating on to the next. The universe will send you someone that's better suited for you, you know, at that time and place in your life. So always take a lesson uh, and treat it as a blessing. You know, breakups are lessons and blessings. There's a, there's a, there's a lesson and there's a blessing in that uh, separation when a woman decides. They're very fickle. 
they're very uh, fastidious and they go off of their emotional guidance system. You know what I'm saying? Logic doesn't really work with them. So that's what I want you guys to know. She's never really yours, it's just your turn. Because think about it, nothing here lasts forever in this realm, right? <clears throat> everything deteriorates, everything. You buy a brand new car and a couple of, and as soon as you drive off a lot, what? It starts to depreciate in value. You buy your house, if you don't maintain it, you know, with maintenance and upkeep and shit like that, excuse me, I've got, got something in my beard, it's gonna deteriorate. Your body, as you age, it starts to deteriorate. We all get older and things like that, right? So you have to keep up with your maintenance and upkeep. So, you know, having said that, I don't want to make this video too long. Just know that everything has a departure date. Everything has a an expiration date. You know, nothing is uh, forever in this realm. Now, we are all energy. We know that energy can only be what? Transferred, but never destroyed. So we are eternal. But in these avatars, in these bodies, of course not. You know what I mean? So enjoy your time with that person, whether it be a long-term relationship or just someone you're just dating and having fun with and things like that. Enjoy your time with them. Have fun with them. You know what I'm saying? Have bliss with them. And when things go awry, you know, appreciate your time with them. And, you know, that's just what it is. Guys, uh, that's it, man. I'm, gonna make, I'm not going to make the video too long. Too long. <clears throat> Listen, go ahead and grab my book. How to Be a High Value Man, The Blueprints of Successful Women, Volume 2. It's available in, uh, in paperback and audiobook. Um, if you just Google the book, it's also on um, Kindle, too. So it's available in ebook as well. You know what I mean? Guys, hit me up on Instagram, you know. Follow me on Instagram. You know what I'm saying? Shoot me a DM topic for another, uh, you know, video, video suggestion. Guys, like, share, subscribe. Like my shit, share my shit, subscribe to my shit, and comment on my shit. You know what I'm saying? Let's override this algorithm. And let's get the channel up to 2K, you feel me? And we're not we're not really far off, you know what I'm talking about? So, that's just what it is. I will see you guys next video. Love and peace. Hey. Love. Peace. I could Yo. pull up in a drop top, shawty round me, shit demon. I got used to the high life and never came back for a reason. It's a couple niggas I trust, a couple niggas just can't believe them. A lot of people did me wrong.